Top 7 Flutter Hidden Tips and Tricks The first widget that nobody talks about is the grid paper. You can change the color, the divisions, the intervals and the subdivisions. The next one is the app size. It is actually possible to see what make the size of your application inside the div tools. To see this information, you will need to go inside the Dart div tools and then you will go inside the app size tab and you will go inside analysis. This is a very important tip because small app size have better chance to be downloaded by the user. Now we will talk about the phone orientation. To know if the phone is vertical or horizontal, you can use the media query .orientation. This widget is very uncommon and it is called the flow widget. This one is actually used to create this parallax scrolling effect. The code is from Flutter and the link is in the description. Next, we have the wheel pop scope. The back button from Android can be controlled with this widget called the wheel pop scope. Show search. If you need a search bar inside your Flutter application, you can use the show search. And for this, you only need to create a class that extends the search delegate. I will add a code example inside the description of the video. The next one is the Cupertino button. The iOS buttons have a specific style. And to recreate this, you can use the Cupertino button. This is the best comment from the last video. Thanks.